Ooh, that soup smells delicious, Polly. It's mango, spinach and beetroot. <laughs> Five seconds. Here we go. You look like a mushroom in that hat. All chefs wear hats like these. And they must look like mushrooms too. <laughs> Let the soup go. <laughs> But I was only trying to help. I know you were. Now get out! <laughs> you stressy. Oh, it's so exciting, I can't say anything. Exciting game? The scores are tied. Could I watch for you to Max now? No! Go on, my son. You can do it. You can do it. Ten seconds. Nine, eight, seven, one. Whoa! No! What's happened? Ooh, could be a fuse. Where's the fuse box? Right at the back of the cupboard under the stairs. Go! Yo! Go, Muta Max! And now back to more Mutant Max. Kitchen. Kitchen. <laughs> Oh, Tiny Chef, we're so far behind schedule. <laughs> oh, the cream must be chilled by now. <laughs> I'm doing pancakes. Polly's letting me toss them. But I'm really good at tossing pancakes. Henry, please, now really isn't the time. <laughs> That's mine. <sighs> <sighs> Does anyone else smell smoke? <gasps> the pancakes! Oh. Oops! Henry! What? <laughs> Are you okay, Polly? <laughs> no! No! I'm not okay! <laughs> It's ruined! <gasps> My perfectest, most romantical dinner ever is ruined! <gasps> All I ever wanted was to make Polly Pops happy! <laughs> and now it's ruined! <laughs> Gross Class Zero, of course. No, wait! It is Gross Class Zero! Look! Hmm. All right, then. Right, I'll just put the film on and... Uh, not so fast, Henry. We have to vote on whether or not the club members want to see the film. Yeah, Henry. But there isn't much time before dinner. We've got to hurry. All those in favour of watching Gross Class Zero... Let's start! All those against? Motion carried. Finally! Now we just need to agree what you're giving me in return for letting you use my DVD player. What I'm giving you? But if you want to watch your film here, you have to let me be the leader of the Purple Hang Gang for a week. What? No way! Fine. Then you can watch your film somewhere else. Yeah, Henry. Oh, all right! You could be leader for a week. Now, can we just watch? Annie, like, has to pass around the popcorn. But you're right next to it! Do you want to see the film or not? Yes, yes! I'll do it! Here. But can we just watch the film now, please? Put it on, then, and hurry up about it. Yeah, Henry. What are you waiting for? Super duper happy tastic hippo fun! Why did you say you had 
Heroes Class Zero when you really wanted to watch Happy Hippos just like a baby. Yeah, Henry, a baby. Oh, no! <laughs> I must have mixed up the DVDs! <laughs> happy, happy, happy from our heads to our toes. Henry, why are you so late? We've all been waiting for you. Who cares? You'll care when you lose your pocket money for another week. Here's your DVD, Worm. The Bumper Wumper Nappy Wappy Soft Rubbish for Wormy Babies. Mum! Stop being horrid, Henry. Oh, that reminds me. I picked up a film at the library today. Gross Class Zero. <gasps> you like Gross Class Zero? Of course. I used to love it when I was a kid. Snort, bogey, fart, poo. We're all sick and so are you. <laughs> Can I watch it with you? Well, that was the plan. It's much too late now. If we'd had dinner on time, you could have watched it together. But now it's way past your bedtime. No! <laughs> yeah! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Woo! -hoo! I'll <laughs> get you, Henry! Over your shoulder, aim and cast in one perfect motion. Oh dear. Oh, uh, <laughs> yes. Oh dear. <laughs> You might catch a flying fish, Dad. <laughs> so, what lesson have we learned, Henry? Never, Never cast, cast a line, line under, under a tree. tree. Ah, yes, that's right, Henry. Ooh, I think I've got something. Ah, hat. What? Oh, you! What? Oh, uh, oh uh, I do beg your pardon, madam. Oh, take liberties with my hat, you naughty man! Huh? <laughs> <laughs> you big bunny! It was just an accident. <sighs> Why does everyone have to beep their car horns? Anything to eat, Mom? Yes, sweetheart. I've got some organic crackers. Mmm, goody! Mm. I spy with my moving people! Okay, Henry, let's get serious. Watch and learn, Henry. <laughs> Mother. Hello, dear. How's uh, I'm a lady going? <laughs> Sorry, dear. You'll have to speak up. Oh, dear. Oh, I see. Yes. Uh, well, um. Oh, 
Horse Worm. What have you got in there? Nothing! You have to let me see. <laughs> I'm telling Mum. Why? You can't! They're not mine! You mean you stole them, Annie? Of course not, Bogey Brain. I'm looking after them for someone. <laughs> Listen, this is top secret, OK? Promise you won't tell anyone. Best boy's honour. You know the pet shelter in town? Well, they've run out of money. They, uh, spent it all on dog food. Oh, no! Yeah, so that's why someone's got to look after all these pets. You mean they've got nowhere to go? They're homeless. <sighs> but, Henry, how are you going to feed them all? Good point. We need pet food. Now, where can we find it? Oh, I know. In the kitchen. Can I help? Please, Henry, please. Well, OK. But remember, this is a top secret mission. Don't tell Mum and Dad. And never, ever leave this door open. Yes, Lord High Majesty. Now, what are my orders? You keep Mum talking. I'll handle the food supplies. Come on. gave me a gold star for this story. And Poppy the Purple Fairy said... I know. Let's all go back to my house for fairy cakes and... Whoa! Oh, oh, oh that, that was lovely, Peter. Thanks, Mum. I'll read you the rest tomorrow. Brain? I didn't, Henry. You did. You did? You did. Oh, we've got to find them before Mum does. Otherwise, rabbit pie. No! Yeah, little bunny bunny. <laughs> Coming. Henry! 
done it! Okay, Amy. Now put the battery back in, and you should have a signal. And it looks like Actin Athletic are making a substitution. Oh, cool! Thanks, Brian! Oh, sorry, Mum, I got lost. Yes, well, everyone is waiting for you in the dining room. Okay. How nice for us all to be together at last. Hmm, with no distractions. And it's a through ball to McAnally. He's been quite the better. Look what I've got, my little chickadee. And he's beaten another defender. It's just the goal. I declare detention over. Phone. Oh, real phone. sure who phoned you? Well, if Henry has to catch up with the rest of the class, we suggest you give him extra homework. Oh, uh, I see. <laughs> OK, then. Extra homework it is. Thank you, Ralph. And, um, well done on your promotion. Go carefully. Extra homework? What are you doing? Well, I got rid of them, didn't I? Who is it? What a day! End of term report books. You need to fill them all in, Headmaster. It'll take ages to do those. Oh, no holidays for me then. Peter? Here. I heard it with my own eyes. No holiday. No holiday. No holiday. <gasps> he can't do that. No. So, off with the head! 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 Let's see what you're made of now. I was head. What? You mean? Oh no, which ones? Oh, just mine and yours. Here you go, Mum. What's for tea? Henry, you're ahead! 
to me, Buster. <laughs> <laughs> you owe me, Margaret. Do I? Whatever for? Oh, look, Margaret. It's raining sweets. Payback time, Margaret. Oh, silly me. I nearly forgot to vote for you, Henry. Here you go. Peter, whatever are you doing out here? Miss Oddboard, could I ask you a question? Of course you can, Peter. Which name do you like best, Tiddles or Buster? That 47, 48, 49 votes for Buster! Yes! <laughs> you haven't won yet. Well, how many votes did the worm get? That's... 45, 46, 47, 48 votes for Tiddles! And one more makes 49! I demand a recount! Buster Tiddles! Potato Brain, who are you talking to? Obviously not you, Turnip Head. That's Buster! You've got Buster! <laughs> no, I haven't. This is Fifi. That's Tiddles. No, it's not. It's Fifi. She's living with us now. But oh, I don't understand. Oh, watch and learn, Pea Brains. <whistles> Is a girl? Yeah, Buster was a girl. <laughs> What's well, so funny? Well, I suppose the question now is, what are we going to call this lot? <laughs> 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 Woohoo! <laughs> I'll get you, Henry! Hello. What's Worm Boy up to? Oi! Where's me tea? Hello, little wormies. Don't be scared. I'm here to protect you. Oh, stinky worm breath. What are you doing? This flower bed is a protected area, home of the very rare red saddled weed worm. Yeah, and this flower bed needs weeding, with one big weed needing special attention. <laughs> hmm, where's Moody Margaret got to? I don't like this. Oh no! What's up with you? I picked up a stinger by mistake. I need a plaster. Ow! Will I live? Unfortunately. Come on then. Will I need to go to hospital? Yes, if you don't be quiet. You! <laughs> here was telling me all about your little job. Sugar? Oh, thanks, love. What are you up to? Job sharing. Parky's agreed to let me share your job. We'll split the wages 50-50. Oh, it's my Saturday job. She makes a lovely cup of tea, does Margaret. <laughs> Looks like we'll be supervising together, eh, hey, Henry? You bribed him with tea! You stole my job! 
right! <sighs> so why won't you do what I tell you to do? I don't know. It's... Margaret. Oh, I get it. She's bribing you too! Well, I'll offer you double what she's offering. Oh, I don't know. OK, triple then. You're on. We'll see who's boss around here. He's offered you triple? Yeah. Well, I'll quadruple anything he's triple, get it? <laughs> yeah! Yeah, yeah, yeah! <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> Change a nappy. Change a nappy? Change, change a nappy? Ah, I've changed more nappies than you've had hot meals, Henry. Have you really? No, but I'm not going to tell him that. All right then, tell me how to do it. Uh, what are we going to do now? I know how to change a nappy. You do? Yeah, my mum gets me to change my baby sister's nappy all the time. What are you whispering about? Uh, nothing. Do you want to know how to change a nappy or not? Go on, then. Uh, well... But tell me, then, what's it worth? <gasps> Three chocolate biscuits. Four. Oh, deal. Now tell me. First, you undo the nappy. Yeah, I'd work that bit out. You wipe away the yucky stuff. OK. Wiping away the yucky stuff. <laughs> girls rule. Girls are cool. Down with boys. Girls rule. Girls are cool. Yeah. Down with boys. Girls are cool. Girls are cool. Yeah. Down with boys. Girls rule. Girls are cool. Yeah. Down with boys. Be quiet. I can't hear myself. Mr. Snot for Brains. Yeah, Snot for Brains. <sighs> Look, just tell me what to do next. It's not easy, you know. <laughs> well, if it was easy, anyone would be able to do it. Including you, Henry. <laughs> <laughs> tell me. Oh, all right, then. <laughs> you put the clean nappy on. Put the clean nappy on. Right. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Yeah, yeah, yeah. We <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> Cockroach farts. Well, that's 
silly question. Hello? Zuckazoo? You have cockroaches there, right? Great. How often does a cockroach fart? What? Oh, of course I'm serious. Hello? I hung up. Peter, could you look something up for me? What? I just need to know how often a cockroach farts. Ugh, that's disgusting. Do it, Worm. Mum, Henry's trying to make me look up cockroach farts on the computer. Shh, you're such a poopy pants. Go and find your own cockroach. wanted to thank you all for coming and on behalf of the whole family say how much we'll all miss you. Except me. I won't miss you. Don't be horrid, Henry. Here you are, Henry. We all club together. It's something to help you remember us all as you start your new life. Oh, thanks. Maybe I will miss some of you then. What is this? It's a snow globe. Look, it snows when you shake it. Sorry, Henry. Oh, I hope my new friends are more generous than you lot. That's it, Henry. Go to your room. And no TV or pocket money or sweets ever again. Uh, hello, Henry. Thanks for coming, Ralph. I, uh, I wanted to say I, uh, well, you know, the other day... Yes, Henry? Well, when I said what I said... Yes, Henry? Well, I'm... Henry! Lots of very special bunnies coming through! Woohoo! I'm... You 
You know what I mean, Ralph. Yeah, I do. Well, see you, Henry. Yeah, see you, Ralph. Just one last thing to do before I go. <laughs> Off you go, my lovelies. Ha, she won't be forgetting me in a hurry. Henry, we've got some good news. We're not moving! What? After all that? Mr Bob saw how many people came to the party and said he couldn't take us away from such good friends and neighbours. So, we're staying, Henry, just like you wanted. Are you happy now? Are you being horrid, Henry? <laughs> you bet I am! <laughs> yeah! Yeah, yeah, yeah! <laughs> Woo hoo! <laughs> I'll get you, Henry! Come on, Henry. Time for school. You still can't believe Fang's gone. I know, Henry. But it's still time for school. Again for school? Uh, I don't know. Would you mind giving this to Henry? He forgot it again this morning. Thanks, Bert. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Stop now! If we're going to have any chance! 
Dalton wedding. We'll never make it on foot. Wait here. Oh, no, you don't. Ready, Ralph? Ready for what? I don't want to be late. Oh, all right then. Ow! Hmm. Oh, cool school. I'll take this one. Come on, we don't want to be late for BB Silver. And if there's any trouble today, Henry, you will not be meeting BB Silver. Yes, Mum. Henry, this is our stop. Henry, come on! My book! Oh, no! And remember, it's Mrs Mossy, not Mrs Bossy. Ah, there you are. How nice of you to join us. Hello, Mrs. Bossy. Uh, I mean, Mossy. Uh, hello, Doggy. While it's quiet, I thought we could do a little bit of stock taking in the storeroom. Certainly, Mrs. Mossy. Uh, I'll just sit here, shall I, and wait? Oh, no, Henry. I've got a little job for you, too. Come with me. There you go, Henry. All those books need stacking on these shelves here. And there are plenty more where those came from. Right. I've finished! Stacking the books. Time for a snack, I reckon. Mm. What'll it be? Fizzy gumball or gooey gudger? I'm putting some more books out for you to unpack. Oh, yes, Mrs. Mossy. Hello? Hello? Oh, Henry, nice to see you using your day off wisely. Oh, hello, Mr. 
Miss Lovely. Can you help me with a book on emotional expression? Sometimes it's better to get it out to your system. I won't lie to you, it's for a friend. Uh, yes, Miss Lovely. Let's have a look under E, shall we? Hello? Anyone there? Uh, off you go, Henry. I can manage on my own. Oh, it's all the way up there. <laughs> yeah! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Woo hoo! <laughs> I'll get you, You could fool us for long? I don't know. And so you see, we can't really take a kid with us on tour. No, you can't. Mind you, uh, he's a pretty good drummer. Really? Good luck, Henry. Yeah, thanks. Nice try, Henry. Can I watch that Magnus Big Blue program? Of course you can, Peter. I've got to see. We interrupt this afternoon's show to bring you an important announcement. Woo! Ed Banger is no longer nice. He has decided to rejoin the Killer Boy Rats. Oh, no! For the latest on this story, we go live to the Crooked Corner. Ed, tell us what made you change your mind. Eh, uh, I don't know. Uh, he says it happened during one of his concerts. Uh, when a young boy called Henry showed him the error of his way. Huh, that's horrid, Henry, to you. Whoa! Henry, there's a very long black car outside. So? And the driver says he's waiting for you. What? Come on, Henry. We're going in a stretched limo. Where to? To see the Killer Boy Rats, of course. Understood, boy. Beneath that horrid outside beats a heart of um, really nice stuff. Sorry, Henry. Um, though he didn't want me to bring this up, he's raised money for charity. And which charity was that? A misunderstood child, miss. I see. I put it to you that Henry is a saint. He was about to save that kitten when Peter sneaked in before him. And, and he loves animals, don't you, Henry? He loves, he loves animals. animals. Let's talk 
about how much you love animals, Henry. I can't help it if Fluffy's a bit sensitive. The list goes on. Are these the actions of a cat-loving hero? No. These are the actions of one horrid Henry. Yes, horrid, horrid. Well, have you come to a decision? Those in favour of Peter, six. Those in favour of Henry, six. <gasps> Silence in court. Uh, Mum, I'd like to call a special witness. What? I'd like to call Tiddles. <gasps> you want to call the kitten? That's crazy! That kitten knows the truth. Bring in the kitten. Tiddles, can you see the person who rescued you in this courtroom? He says, yes! Objection! Kittens can't speak, stupid! <gasps> Enough! Peter, Henry, stand in the middle of the room. Whomever Tiddles goes to is telling the truth. Hello, Tiddles! Do not distract the witness. should just about cover the damage to my shed door. Take him down! No! Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Yeah, yeah, yeah! <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> I'll get you, Don't worry, you won't need brakes. Oh, uh, okay. Dad! A job well done. It's really heavy! You need less traction and more lift. Get lost, worm! Don't be horrid, Henry. Any ideas, Peter? You 
are my little pumpkin pop? You bored, Mum, from a short bat treating! No, it isn't. You're just jealous. My go-kart has its own engine, power steering, electric windows, glove compartment, heated seats. Huh. Shall I go on? Don't yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> I'll get you, Henry! Hello? It's me. I want to speak to my mum and dad. Why? Because I'm coming home. I hate it here. If she comes home now, I'm out of the game. I'm sorry, oh, they can't come to the phone right now. Call back next week. Bye! <gasps> uh oh! Hi, oh, I uh, need something. Out of the loft. Out of the loft? The only thing up there is Margaret's old stuffed toys. Yes, that's what I need. Stuffed toys. Lots of them. Now! OK, Henry, OK. Which ones did you want? Um, all of them. Oh, uh, there's the door. I I'd best come down. Uh, it's OK. I'll get the door. Oops. Well, what about the ladder, Henry? Oh, don't worry. I'll put it back in a minute. Yes, who is it? You know who it is, Henry. Now get me my mum and dad. Oh, I'm afraid they're busy right now. Why don't you come back next week? Oh, I'm going to get you. I'm going to win the cash prize first. There's one new to Max coming. I want it now. Coming right up, Henry. Here it is, Henry. And I've got you the new Killer Boy Rat CD as well. Do you have the new Super Mega Soaker yet, Henry? Um, not sure. Maybe. One dungeon drinks kit for you, Margaret, just like you asked for. And, um, here are the tickets for the football. That's better! And I want shepherd's pie for tea, not that cabbage again. Uh, yes, yes, Margaret. Margaret. <laughs> oh, I can't find anything in here! And everything in here is pink! Be moody, Margaret. Not Margaret. I'm Henry. <gasps> Wait a minute. I'm turning into moody Margaret. It's just not worth it. I want to go home. Please. Nonsense, Henry. We can't send you home. We like having you here. <laughs> yeah! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> I'll get you, Henry! Oh, more ice cream! It's just not fair! Fancy a carrot stick, Henry? No, thanks. Not unless it's carrot stick ice cream. Hey? Everyone's eating vegetables! It's hard, Henry. I should know. Henry! Peter! Tea time! I'm hungry. What's for tea? Ooh, sausages? Yes, Henry. Carrot sausages. Mmm, yummy! What? Carrot sausages? With boiled carrots and carrot mash. Why are there so many carrots? Don't be horrid, Henry. They're really good for you. What's for pudding? Carrot cake. Can you believe this? And so, what the Romans decided to do? Oh, let's see what's on the other side. This is a really squirmy salad with aubergines, apricots, peppers and courgettes. Chuck on a bit of basil and some grated carrot and your almond dry. Beautiful. Oh, it's a vegetable! Get me out of here! Ice cream, more carrot. 
Jones. And this just in. From today, ice cream will no longer exist. I repeat, ice cream has become extinct.